Atlanta iconic entertainers honored for their contributions to the culture. The 2022 Black Music and Entertainment Walk of Fame Award Ceremony. It happened along Northside Drive this morning, right in the shadow of Mercedes-Benz Stadium. CBS 46's Tori Cooper shows us the new walk honoring generations of legendary artists. It's a new place where you can walk alongside the icons and legends in the black music industry. I think it's just a beautiful way to let folks know, not just acknowledging the past, but inspiring the future. Record executive Michael Malden, who also happens to be the father of R&B legend Jermaine Dupri, had a vision three years ago to create one place where the culture of black music, excellence and education could meet in one place. We did feel like Atlanta, just for the future, and always, not just music, but also in film and television now, uh, that this was really the birthplace. His vision became a reality Wednesday on the corner of MLK Drive outside of the Mercedes-Benz Stadium in downtown Atlanta with a new Black Walk of Fame featuring icons like Ray Charles, Smokey Robinson, New Edition, and even Barry Gordy, who founded Motown Records. That he is documented and, and memorialized here is so exciting uh, for me and my family. His daughter, Rhonda Ross, feeling grateful that her father's story is just one of many others now cemented in Atlanta. To document what's happened, what, what we've accomplished. And in the city's new black music and entertainment walk of fame. The education for our next generation. Now make sure that if you do come out here to learn more about the stories of black excellence and in the black music industry, you use the QR code that's out here so that you can really touch base and really dig in to the stories and their legacy. Reporting in downtown Atlanta, I'm Tori Cooper, CBS 46 News.